Okay, Pisces, don't dim to fit in. How are you dimming your light in order to fit in? Pisces, you're a beautiful, deep sign. So make sure that you are being authentic with your emotions, being authentic with your feelings, and being authentic, I want to say, with your self-expression here, Pisces. There's no reason. If people, if you're too complicated for people, then move on. But don't, don't regress yourself because people can't conceptualize you as a being. In your present permission, present permission, I'm going to say you need to give yourself permission for that because that was very strange that that came out. You have the hermit card, truth, guide, facts, and wisdom here, okay? So when we see the hermit, it's about kind of going within, taking a time, a reprieve, a rest, um, slowing things down. And if you need to slow things down, that way you can appreciate who you are in your authenticity. That way you can recognize where you might be dimming in, where boundaries might need to be put back up. Okay, so let's see what we have in the near future. A romantic new cycle begins. New moon in Libra, Pisces. Look at that. And interestingly enough, we have the Lady Justice or Lady Themis rather. She has her scales here, right? So it's kind of like equal give and take. So when I see this romantic cycle is beginning, it's going to be with someone who is going to match your energy, I feel like, who is just, who is fair, and is going to match you, Pisces. I feel like this is a big deal for you. Okay, you have as your totem animal, now in the correct position, you have dog, loyalty, discipline. There's a message here. Be disciplined in your home and community life. Archangel Zariel. Okay, also interestingly enough, dogs are the companions that teach us how to play. That's their animal energy spirit. Um, that they're trying to bring into your life. Teaching you how to play and not take life so seriously. Cats are so different. And we all know that. Um, so I feel like here it's like make sure that you're being disciplined in your, es I want to say aesthetic. It's so weird. Discipline in your aesthetic. I guess discipline in the way you are uh, showcasing yourself to the world. Make sure that you're staying authentic and staying in alignment with who you are. And that you're being loyal to you, right? You're being just loyal to you. This is what I see for this. Let's see. Now you actually get that card that I picked a moment ago by accident. You get the great teacher card. Learn from your spiritual experiences. And he is also holding the dove. So with this dove, this is peace. This is wishes being fulfilled. Also, this is spirit supporting you to uplift you. Um, you know, there's a purity that we see when we see dove. This is why dove is all white because it has transformed. And I feel like for you, Pisces, there's definitely a transformation happening here for you. All right, let's see what you have for your angel blessing cards. And just so that you guys know, these angel blessing cards that I pull for you guys are not tarot cards. I work with these as I work with the angels. And these are just a visual interpretation of the blessing that is being put into your energy field right now. You have Angel Gabriel blessing you with self-discovery this week. And then Angel Raphael blessing you with opportunity this week. So make sure that you claim these blessings into your life. That way they can actually uh, come in. Angels want to work with you, but you have free will. So therefore, you have the chance to say no. So if you want this blessing in your life, make sure you claim it in the bottom right there in the comment section below. Hi, guys. How are you? Thanks for being here. We have Virgo in the house and Virgo's son. Yes. All right. So I hope that serves you.